welcome back to Done With Depression. This video is going to be about how I completely changed my life. So before we talk about changing my life, we have to start from the beginning, uh, where I was before. So I've struggled with depression pretty much my entire life. Uh, I remember at a very young age crying myself to sleep at night because I didn't have any friends. Um, it really started for me in middle school. Uh, there had been stuff that happens as a kid and life ev events that happen that aren't the greatest, but everyone deals with them differently. But in middle school, it all kind of really hit. And I remember that's when a lot of the suicidal thoughts and that sort of thing started happening. And so I had had these issues for a lot of years but last year was the first time that I ever tried to get help. So it's kind of unique looking back right now. It's been about a year since the first time I ever uh, got help or talked to a therapist or anything about um, what had been going on in my life. But uh, it had gotten really bad. There was a point where uh, I had been in a long-term relationship with someone and I remember wanting to take my life so bad, but I knew that if I did, the other person would probably take their life as well. And the only reason that I didn't was for that other person. So that's kind of getting to how low I was at that time, is that my own self-worth was so low that I didn't care about myself, but I wanted to live so that the other person would live. So over this past year, I've gone through two breakups. I've done pretty much everything that Kaiser offers. I've been in inpatient programs multiple times. I've done partial hospitalization multiple times. I've done in, uh, IOP, the intensive outpatient program multiple times and uh, numerous classes as well, as long as, uh, as well as doing the therapy sessions and all of that. So if you guys don't know, with Kaiser right now, they're really impacted, so it's really hard to be able to see your therapist on the regular, but uh, you get an appointment about once a month. So I've been doing that and that's been helping as well. But over the last year, the major thing that really changed me from where I was to where I am now is just saying yes to more things. I was always so guarded before and I always had every excuse in the book on why I couldn't do something. Whether it was vacation or going to a family dinner or hanging out with people or whatever I always had an excuse for it I was working or I was tired or my back hurt or I had to get up early the next day or I couldn't get the time off work or they called me in or whatever I had the excuse for everything and over this last year uh, including not working anymore but more than just that I have really opened myself up to saying yes to more things so as you guys have probably seen in my videos, I'm doing a little bit of everything right now. I'm doing woodworking, um, I'm doing traveling in the van, I have the property in Oregon in the dome, and just random things like magnet fishing and going on walks and just being outside and the lighthouses and all of that. It's just saying yes. This year I drove all the way out to Kansas from California because I had a friend out there and he asked me if I wanted to go to a Raiders game. I did the same thing going out to Colorado a separate time. He said, hey man, I got a place to stay. If you want to come out here, we'll go to the game. And I just made a trip out of it. Um, I had a friend in Washington and we haven't got to hang out in a long time. And so I drove all of Highway 1 and 101 up to Washington. And so for me, it's really just been saying yes to more things and putting myself out there. And with that comes happiness and enjoyment and uh, being social and meeting more people and all of that sort of thing. And it also gives you something to look forward to. 
um, when I think of depression, I think of depressed, meaning to like press down something or keep it down. And that's really what you're doing to yourself when you're not letting yourself do anything. And I found that just by saying yes and doing more things and putting myself out there, it completely changed my life. Um, before I had had some money, but I wasn't doing as well in the stock market. I was really good at saving, but the like performance of my stocks and such hadn't been as great. And that's completely changed now. I figured out a new thing that's working for me that's doing really well. Um, I was able to buy property. Both of my um, cars are paid off. I bought the van this year. And I've just been able to do so much more and it's given me so much more self-worth. Um, I'm alone for the first time in my life, like not being in a relationship. I've pretty much almost always been in a relationship since like seventh grade. And I'm alone now and I'm mostly okay with that. I am just doing my own thing and if someone comes along, they come along, but I've never been comfortable with that before. I've always needed someone else to hold me up, someone else to make me feel good about myself. And I still have my down days. I still am sad sometimes. I'm still depressed sometimes. I still overreact or am too sensitive sometimes to certain things, but you just have to notice it and try and move on. and notice the feeling that you're having and realize that it's only temporary and just kind of go from there. So that's really how I changed my life this last year. It's so weird now looking back. The year seemed so long. It was such a struggle and so many things happened and just major life events from quitting my job to not living on my own anymore, to traveling, to being in an inpatient hospital, to doing all these different programs and not having insurance and getting insurance again. And just everything has been such a struggle this last year. And I'm really hoping that it gets better this year and I have a better year and it's been a lot better so far. So. Let me know if you guys have any questions in the comments. Give this video a thumbs up and I'll see you guys next time on Done With Depression.